Okay, so we're going to talk about FFA official dress and how girls should wear it and how boys should wear it. What you need for official dress and how to wear your hair during these LDE competitions. Girls should have pantyhose. They will be the footy pantyhose and make sure they are the color jet black. If your pantyhose starts to tear, you can use hair stri- hairspray or nail glue to hold them together. That's just a little tip. You want a black pencil skirt that is not super tight but fits properly and is about short is no shorter than two inches above the knee. You want a white button up shirt, an official FFA gel jacket, an official dress scarf. Those are all pretty self explanatory. But for your heels, you every picture I have seen is matte black stiletto heels. And according to the handbook, they are not supposed to be above two inches. I normally get mine like one inch and a half to two inches. So that's what I would suggest. Boys wear dress pant, black dress pants that fit properly. White button-up shirt, official FFA jacket. Black dress shoes. Boys, they need to be the shoes you would wear to church or to a nice event. They do not need to be some ratty black shoes. For a set of a scarf, you will wear a bow tie or a tie, which has the FFA on it. The tie is preferred. Boys, for your hair, make sure... You do not have hat hair. Make sure your hair is brushed. Do your hair if you have a style. Girls, make sure your hair is done nice. Most FFA members choose to wear half up, half down. It's come the FFA official hairstyle, like the one seen here. You can see her top half of her hair is pulled up in a bun. It can be in a bun or a ponytail. If you choose not to do half up, half down, make sure your hair is not in your face. And do not fidget with your hair during a contest. For certain events, girls can wear black dress pants, but you will have to check the contest score sheet to see if it is of like if it is acceptable. Thank you.